What's up everybody, Big Will, K-Pop for Life, coming at ya. And before we get into this video, I just wanted to give a quick, heartfelt shout out and thank you to all my new Patreon supporters over on Patreon.com. <laughs> Uh, you'll see all their names listed at the end of this video, but just so you guys know um, This is just I'm releasing this video as sort of um, This is kind of some of the content that you'll be getting if you're a patreon supporter uh, Going forward the unedited uncut mix with sort of behind the scenes shit that I cut out kind of stuff um, different look at, at how the channel functions when I haven't prettied everything up and, and made it look and sound a little better, which is really difficult to do when you're this ugly. <laughs> and uh, there's also other kinds of uh, content, including types of swag and stuff that you can get if you're a Patreon supporter. So please go uh, to the link in the description below and uh, support, if you can, K-pop for life. And if you can't, that's fine too. Leave a like, hit, hit the subscribe button. And um, again, thank you from the bottom of my heart to all my new patron supporters. You guys are the shit. I promise you tons of content. And I promise you a close-knit community on Patreon. If there's anything else you want me to do, you let me know. Let's get in to the video. Because it probably sucks. No. I mean, oh, wait. I like Exide's general kind of feel. They just, I don't know, they're one of these groups that tends to fly under most people's radar they never quite get that next level of respect that any other more popular are you group... recording yeah all right good yeah but uh, any other more popular group would have uh would have gotten a long time ago i mean they had and it probably doesn't help them that soji their like lead vocalist their main singer mm -hmm. has been out with the fuck was it called hyperthyroidism uh, so I don't know if she's even back in this or not, but we're about to watch that new Exide or EXID, however the fuck you want to say it, lady. And, uh, lady. I always just think of Buckwheat from Saturday Night Live with Eddie Murphy from like the seventies. You know, <gasps> uns, ties, feet times a maiden. <laughs> Buckwheat Buck things. <laughs> When Eddie Murphy was good. Yeah, when he was still funny. <laughs> Pre Nutty Professor 2. But uh And and triplets. Yeah, let's 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 do the intro real quick and I'll splice these together. All right. <laughs> What's up everybody? Big Will. Medium in K pop for life. <laughs> Shooting out of order. It's all fucked up. <laughs> I'm gonna jump to what we were just talking about now. Okay. You just went back in time. Yeah. It's pretty amazing. Now I'm gonna jump to after what we would have talked about now. <laughs> so like I was saying, <laughs> this is gonna be sucky to edit. It's gonna be awesome. This is the new Exide song. Uh, I'm not that hyped about it. I don't know anything about it. I didn't like DDD. Um, actually, I, I haven't liked really any of their songs since Soldier wasn't there. I feel like uh, they're not bad. I feel like they're just missing something and I'm not a huge like fanboy for Exide, so. Uh, the song has to be good to grab me. But I love Hani and Solji. Do you want me to so grab you? I want you to grab me. Gosh damn, you fucking stink, dude. You take a shower. Balls and farts. <laughs> 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 I didn't say let go. <laughs> Trust me. You, want, you I, don't want that smell caked hey, on you. Just because I smells bad doesn't mean I didn't feel safe. <laughs> <laughs> Told anyone. I feel safe. <laughs> <laughs> Let's get into it. You show me triple D, right? Yeah. yeah. Okay. Da, 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 da. Deep, deep. Okay. Three, two, one. Goose egg. No soldier. Come on, come on, come on, come on, yeah, they're going for that 90s throwback. Wow. Wow, they even got like the VHS haze to it. Oh. I'm so distracted by the music video. Sorry. It's got like a salt and pepper CLC vibe. So much salt and pepper inside. Okay. What's it take to make a white boy bounce? Get it! Oh, 
and I hope this chorus hits because this song is pretty dope so far. That dude was grabbing his crotch hardcore in them overalls. Watching Michael Jackson. Oh shit, they did that old school. Connie with the red hair though. Okay. Dude, I'm not, I really like her flow. I'm not a huge fan of her normally. Like she started sometimes she's good, sometimes she's bad, but her flow in this video is dope as shit. Yeah. That's why she was screaming. She, was like, <laughs> she said, Ow! I'm so distracted by this 90s, like, maze. Yeah, I wish they would clear it up a little bit after the beginning. It's like, I get it. It's the 90s. What's funny is, like, 90s TV didn't look like that. It only looked like that when you got right up to the screen as a kid and you could see all the individual yeah. things. That's because the shitty ass t two TVs. Yeah. Like 2018 Mercedes Jeeps. Are they doing that kid in play? It was the shit. <laughs> That's what I was Seriously, overalls were cool in the 90s. I don't get how they're still around. <laughs> okay then, Exide. Okay, okay then. Did we see it like them looking okay at an old S2 TV? Oh, okay. We did watch know. it. That's the performance video. That's a different video. That's why. <sighs> okay then, Exide. You doing the damn thing. Maybe they're trying to... Break through their glass ceiling. I guess. That, you were talking that shit about. was hot. That shit was hot. I know they're still not going to get the credit they deserve because for some reason everybody just kind of overlooks them. I don't know why, but. Maybe they're waiting for that girl to come back. Like they're. they're no. Bias? Was that the girl's. Like, Soji? Fate? Nah, yeah. I mean, it's probably split, but most people love Hani or the other one, the tall blonde one. But, uh. That, man, that song was hot. It was good. That song was hot. It definitely felt like an old school 90s vibe, but like in a catchy, good way with that slight. Just slightly updated, so it didn't have that 90s cheese to it that a lot of 90s songs have when you listen to them now. But uh, it was hot. The music video was, I know I've said it sometimes, like, it was so distracting. <laughs> I didn't mind it after a while. I wish they would have just got rid of the haze, but aside from that, yeah, I'm just used to K-pop videos popping off the screen. That one was kind of gray-toned because of the thing, but I don't really care. I'm going to download that shit. And I, don't have to, I don't have to watch it when I'm listening to it on my phone. That's true. So <laughs> Way better on the phone. Yeah. That shit was hot. Um, Tactically acquired. Yeah, and um, her the her her fucking rapping was amazing. Yeah, like the, her flow, the way she nailed every line, the way she uh, the way she just hit it, it was dope. Yeah, flow she hot. spit them bars. She, she was probably one of the six greatest rappers of five, all time. <laughs> you know who the first five are? I don't know. Was it Dylan, 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 and Dylan? Spit hot fire! <laughs> <laughs> Let us know what you guys thought in the comments below. If you guys like what you see and you want to see more, click the Teespring link in the description. I'm going and to Korea. I'm trying to go to Korea here. Well, I am going to Korea, but I need money to spend while I'm there. I can't, I can't be begging for food in Korea. They ain't going to give my fat ass any food. I'm like, no, you're fat enough. <laughs> Live off your fat, fat white guy. <laughs> That might be the best diet for you. It might be, yeah. But we'll see. But either way, keep on popping, K-poppers. Remember, it's not a trend. It's a lifestyle. Deuce. <laughs>